Hello, this is Kevin, and this is my project. What's this project about, Kevin? It's a simulation. It's just a simulation of the different objects, and like, for example, Earth. It shows how it would spin on its axis. Mm, okay. And here's an example, another one, Mars. Mm -hmm. I'll show you the code for these two in a moment. Okay. And it spins. Alright, so. Here we have Mars. And uh, this is the color of the backdrop or the background. Mm -hmm. It's black because there's no red, no green, or blue. Mm -hmm. And basically I created an object of 40 this size. And I loaded this image, which means that uh, I had to put the path so that it would run the XE and be able to find it easily. Okay. And I textured object one with this image, object object one with, with image, image one. one. And it does this loop where it just rotates the object this degree at this speed, basically. Mm -hmm. And then it refreshes the screen and loops again. Okay. And it's very simple code for that one. And this is the Earth. It's on its axis, and it's a little bit more complicated mm -hmm. because it has to do the uh, it has to be on its tilt, and it's more or less the same except out of the loop you have to have it on a tilt so it would just stay that way, and that's basically it for the dark basic code. Now the VB code is a little bit more complicated because, well, for each one you have to do systems.diagnostics.process.start, and you have to tell it the path of where to go to get to these different places mm -hmm. to run the XE, and that's how you do it. So each one is all the same. Basically, each one has to go through, to go, basically tells that direction of where to go to run all these EXEs, which are represented by these buttons here. And well, the close or exit button, that one's the only one that's different. Just me dot close. All right, so that's all. Okay. Was it? Go back to the uh, the code for the Earth. It would be this one. Yeah, I noticed that you've got um, you've got two loops there. Yes. And why do you have? Well, it looks like you're rotating it about two different axes. Um, no, in the same axis. Well, you've Except got Z rotate, then you have Y rotate. Wait, where do I have Z rotate? I only have Y. Under texture object four, four. Texture. Oh, texture object four. Oh, this is uh, to make it tilt a little bit. So it would tilt to that degree. Mm -hmm. And then these two separate loops. Um, Run that again. Run that file. It so it looks like it's it's kind of like okay you're trying to give the impression that it's it's rotating that the way you would see like the Sun right sun yeah if you were the Sun in you're setting the West but it's also from with Z it looks like it's also kind of moving towards you is that what's going on uh, well, the, it's just to, to make it so that the way it spins, uh -huh. it's, like, easier to see. Well, I didn't do uh, Earth. Uh, Chavi did that part. Right. I don't know why there's two loops, but I guess it's to make it look, spin like this. Okay. I did, the, I did some of the other ones, though. Okay. Do you have all of the other ones done? Yes, all of the other ones work. Okay, run that, and let's take a look. Like, like, do uh, which is the one that has rings? Saturn. Uh, the rings I couldn't get to work with the rest of it, so. So, so, well, click Saturn. Do, do you, is there anything for Saturn? Yeah, it's just uh, just it without the rings. Okay, so that's one thing that I'd like for you to work on. 
uh, maybe try to try to mimic rings by intersecting that sphere with like a plane all right and then making like a another sphere that intersects with the plane but the sphere is um, black has the same color as the background so okay. when you intersect a sphere with a black sphere with a with a plane that's not black the what what will happen is it, it'll look like you cut something out of the plane and okay. what's left over is like a ring All right. and maybe you could have that ring rotate around um, around the x-axis maybe to, to give the impression that um, that there's a ring that's rotating around the, the planet okay All right. try to work on that as well All right. okay any questions gentlemen no Okay, very good, Kevin. Thank you. Can I use one of those computers, Mr. Morales? I use mine.